Hey guys, Reese here from Psalm 7117, and today I am finally going to be able to do something I've tr been trying to do a bunch of different times. This is like my eighth attempt to make this video, but uh, today I'm going to be giving a tour of our website. Now I'm not going to show everything. Uh, if you actually want to visit the website and see everything for yourself, the link is in the description of this video. But I'm just going to be going over the highlights, sort of what our website features, so that you guys know what really got us started and why Psalm 7117 exists in the first place. So if you want to visit our website, and um, it, pretend the link isn't in the description, you go to your search engine and type in https colon dash 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 sites dot google dot com slash view slash psalm seven one dash one seven. Now it's a very long URL, we know. We are trying to get a custom one at some point we're hoping to work on that but as of now you have to type in the full address and when you type it in it'll automatically pull up our website which the first thing you see is our theme verse Psalm 7117 oh God you've taught me from my youth and to this day I declare your wondrous works so from there you can click on the little arrow at the bottom and it'll take you to what we do and that of course is we're a group of kids just like any other that feels God's word needs to be spread so that's what we're going to do we're going to fight the good fight, we're going to finish the race, we are going to keep the faith. And really, that's our mission, that's our goal, uh, is to A, make sure that we remain strong in the faith, and B, that we help others in their faith. Uh, so scrolling down from there is the verse of the week, verse of the week, and I put that in quotes because I don't really change it every week. I try to, but um, I mean, sometimes it just slips my mind. I did this one, I think, like yesterday or the day before, so this one's up to date. Uh, Jesus said to the Jews who believed him, if you abide in my word, you are my disciples indeed. John chapter 8, verse 31. I usually add some thoughts, but I mean, this is a pretty simple verse, and that's what I said. Pretty simple verse. Jesus was telling the people that believed him and obeyed his word would be his followers. It's that easy. Um, so down here, we have the link to the Nashville School of Preaching at the Creed Hall Church of Christ. Um, all four of us, me, signed the Oppmans. We've attended there, we've done some classes there. It's really helpful, it'll teach you a lot about the Bible. And so um, we decided that we'd recommend it. We got the approval from, um, I'm not sure if it was the whole board of directors, but we did get permission to advertise that. And uh, down here, we were advertising uh, my dad's company, Focus Press. Uh, I showed some footage of him speaking in one of the Jamaica videos. It might've been like day four, day five. But um, yeah, there's the link to their website there, and we gave this because my dad was one of the ones who advertised when our introduction video came out, so we thought we'd say thank you for giving us that initial boost by advertising his site on our site. And of course, down here, you have a link to our, our email and our Twitter handle, and that's basically our homepage. Um, with a site that has a bunch of different content like we do it's kind of hard to set on one thing for the home page like what are we trying to get at so it's very varied but um that's that's what we were able to come up with for the home page so the next page that you'd visit from there is the team where you'll learn a little bit more about us and i would say the people who've helped us right now there's just one and that's my sister so um we go oldest to youngest so it starts with me age 16 give a little bit about what we've done for the group um, some of our interests, and uh, a quote that each of us gave out. Now, back before we had this channel and we'd revealed ourselves, all that dramatic stuff, um, I actually had a little PowerPoint presentation put up, and uh, each of us had a quote on it while we were telling about ourselves. Mine was, God's word needs to be spread. Who says we can't be the ones who spread it? Uh, Noah says, we need, to, we need to be an example for kids our age. Sai so said, the purpose of our team is to encourage and edify other teens. And uh, Gabe, I joined Psalm 7117. I felt it was a better use of my talents than what most kids my age are doing. And I mean, all those still really apply. This was a year or two back when we wrote these, but honestly, they still apply to all of us. And then um, there's a little subpart for Claire. It's my sister. She's been helping out with like the puzzles and an article. So she helps us out a little, but she's not technically part of the team. So we decided to give her part. Our history and mission page is probably one of the most important relating to the team itself, I'd say. Um, the history just tells us the story of 
how a website started, website basically ended, website came back on, YouTube channel, all that good stuff. And then the mission down here is just basically the what we do on the homepage, but uh, we talk a little bit more about it, like how we decided we weren't doing enough and all that. So um, yeah, that's that page. The next one is Contact Us. Now this is a relatively newer page. Um, we have the link to our email and our Twitter. Um, we did have these on the homepage, but we thought that if somebody just really wanted to contact us for some reason, they'd look for a page that said contact us, and they might have missed it on the homepage, so we just thought we'd better double check. Now this might be my favorite page, the article page. Um, we have gotten a lot of articles since we first started, like we had, we had Noah's Believing in God, and one, I think his radio metric one, and my global flood when we first started, that was it. When it was first published, we had three articles up. And now we have like one, two, three, four, that's four on radio carbon, or two on radio carbon, but that makes four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen articles. Um, I just took the uh, subtitles that I'd written up for size morning point Devo video, and I, um, I put them into an article format, and so his is the latest contribution, so now each of us have at least one article. Now, I'm not going to click on any of them. If you want to read these, you got to visit the site yourself. Again, links in the description. Up next is our Just For Kids page. This one was a bit of an experiment for us. Like, we didn't really know what we were doing back when we first started this. This was, like, one of our earliest pages. But um, it's gone pretty well. We have our quizzes, our puzzles, and our puppet shows linked here. Um, of course, all of these are about the Bible, but they're simple enough that a kid can get them. Um, down here is, again, the weekly challenge. Memorize 10 consecutive verses from the book of Psalms. I mean, I don't update this every week. Honestly, I'd probably update this one less than the verse of the week because I just don't think about it when I come to update the site. So here we have our quizzes. Uh, beginner, advanced, expert. I had to reach into the far back reaches of my brain to get the questions for the um, expert Bible questions. Creation quiz, easy. Gospel quiz, Moses quiz, you know, basic stuff. So from there, we move on to puzzles. And um, these aren't as educational as they are just kind of for fun. Um, if it would load. Um, the creation word search, the flood crossword, Psalm 23, the extreme Bible word search, and the word scramble. So me, Gabe, and uh, Claire have really been the ones involved in this. We don't put these up as much as anything else because I mean I think this is the least visited page if I checked analytics right so if you guys actually want more puzzles and quizzes and stuff make sure you let us know because we will take what you say into consideration when we're thinking of more stuff to put out so from there we move on to the puppet scripts page I laugh every time I see that picture that's from like 2015 and it's it's me and Cy and uh, we're holding the original puppets that these scripts were based on. And it's just like, we look so different back then. And uh, really brings back memories of that trip. But we have our puppet shows on all of these different um, subjects. I ha I've had to write, I think, all of these simply based on, like, a VBS. Somebody will come forward, hey, need this for a VBS. Um, so there might be a few that I just wrote by myself because I'm trying to get a complete book of like puppet scripts for the Old Testament like start in creation end near the prophets I'm trying to get that done so there may be some that were completely original but most of these were written in VBS format so the last page if articles is my favorite this is my second favorite that'd be our YouTube video page because you can watch our videos straight from the website without ever having to visit YouTube um, without having to worry about ads and suggested videos and all that you can just click on the play button and it'll go. We have our trailer, our introduction. It's sort of chronological, sort of based on like what would interest people. See our history, that was our third video. Then the solo course videos are all grouped together. Here's mine, size, the Morning Point Devos, the Jamaica Mission. Uh, I grouped together me and Noah's God's Existent video. Uh, the Why Choose to Believe the Bible, Lab's Leaders, my violin speech. Step Salvation, I'm going to have some more info on that in a future video. We are still working on that. Um, next video should be out either by the end of this month or the end of next month. It's just been really crazy 
um, really been a crazy gear, so we're trying to get on that. It's kind of hard. Down here is our Fruited Spirit, and then our one year anniversary, which is one of my favorite videos because it's just really brief. It's just us talking about what we've been able to do in a year. So yeah, that's our website. It's pretty simple, but this is really what got Psalm 7117 started. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, hope you've enjoyed this. It's kind of a different type of video. But um, please subscribe if you want to be notified whenever we release new videos. Make sure you visit our website so that you can read some of the articles, take some of the quizzes, do some of the puzzles. Links in the description. And uh, if you want some news or updates, either email us at psalm7117website at gmail.com and just say I'd like to receive updates. Or you can follow us on Twitter. We'll be posting whenever we have new videos, new articles, anything like that. Just thank you guys so much for watching.